Welcome back to Television A7. Let's jump into Love & Hip Hop Atlanta Season 11, Episode 4. Now, these two on the screen, Eric and Sierra, both of them a mess. But this scene right here, y'all remember Sierra said she wanted to sneak move out. Well, the sneak part didn't qu quite go over so well because Eric pulled up like, yo sierra what's going on and sierra was like oh i thought you was supposed to be at the dealer or whatever eric was like yo i got keys i just pulled up to my crib and like what is going on so eric is like you packing i should be the one leaving because when we first got together you was praying for me we was praying together this that and the third and kind of find out you was talking to a rapper you smash this rapper and his messages about you know you sending pictures back and forth and what you're going to do to him in the bedroom this that and the third blah 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 so eric's whole thing is like i can't believe i was blinded everybody told me that sierra was a runaway bride and i overlooked it all i overlooked all of it and married her because i just you know i just wanted to do what i wanted to do but now i'm you know having regrets about it i look crazy sierra got me out here looking crazy but eric did have a point though about sierra and the runaway bride because sierra has been engaged what like three times she's gotten three rings I believe correct me if I'm wrong but I believe Sierra likes the idea of being a wife but doesn't necessarily want to be a wife or maybe know how to be a wife I'm not quite sure but it always just seems like when she gets the ring or things get super like you know time to take to the next level it doesn't quite work out and it could be her fault it could be the man's fault or whatever but it's like the it's like a repeat you know it's like the same things kind of keep happening here so but sierra's whole side of things is like wait you know i was fooled too and the only reason i even went off and kind of like married eric like that is because i got in a fight with my family and they kind of pushed me closer to him so boom i just went off and married him but she's like what about you know you got some some uh sexually explicit pictures some p pictures and your phone and eric was like well that's from when we first started dating but sierra and sierra's mom she's standing right here chimed in like look it's all the same thing like you talking about me cheating you cheating too and then sierra is like look i was bamboozled he lied to me about the women that he had and he lied to me about his businesses so basically they both sierra is getting out but they both need to go ahead and end this because it's not good and uh, if if what sierra is saying too about eric not getting along with the kids that's not that's just not gonna work that's not going to work so let me know what you guys think about this whole sierra and eric situation and um who's in the right who's in the wrong i think both of them are in the wrong they probably should have never even gotten married but one thing about sierra like she doesn't really from just from what has been shown on the show she doesn't really take the time to be by herself too long she's always kind of goes from one to the next to the next and that's not really good you got to take time for self instead of just jumping into stuff and then eric i remember they got a home they showed it all on Instagram and then when that home got broken into unfortunately they went and got another home and it's like y'all doing all this stuff together but y'all aren't even married yet it's like just pump the brakes a little bit y'all it's like people just be moving way 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 too fast and then when the train goes off the tracks everybody wants to point fingers 
but anyway let me know what you guys think about that um appreciate you guys watching this television 87 if you guys want to check out more of my love and hip-hop atlanta content got a video right here for you guys and talk to y'all in the next one